I was reading some of your tweets, and I see that you're having trouble hosting your uh, AA meetings. What, what exactly is going on? Well, you know, we haven't been allowed to have our regular AA meetings, which I think is absolutely ridiculous because we we are abiding by the rules and regulations, which is six feet apart. Um, we're all wearing masks, and I, I don't see a problem with it. It's, it's interesting because in a grocery store, you're right on top of each other. People are much closer together. It's much more dangerous. So what we're doing is actually a lot safer. Our meetings are essential. I don't think, like I said, having alcohol delivery service now, I don't see that as essential. And I don't see our cannabis shops as essential either, but they are considered an essential business. Um, we have, okay, look, over 3 million people die every year globally from alcohol-related deaths, far surpassing the coronavirus. So why don't those lives matter? Why are we not considered essential? Do you think there's going to be a rise in alcoholism, you know, with people locked down, sheltering in place, and, you know, getting alcohol delivery? Definitely. I... I, I spoken to so many people uh, at these meetings that tell me that they've relapsed I relapsed oh really uh, yeah I relapsed and I'm not blaming anyone but myself but I'm just here to say that it's people like me like we rely on, on our meetings to get us by we rely on our sober friends to help us through and it's a very difficult time I realize for everyone but if we're conducting our meetings safely I don't see a problem with it and if we are forced to shut down then I will sue our mayor okay so so I will file a lawsuit 